In recent weeks, we've been telling you about the PAWS Act, Puppies Assisting Wounded Service Members. It's a bipartisan bill that would pair veterans with post-traumatic stress and highly trained service dogs. In the course of reporting on this, we realized how many Americans don't actually know how a bill becomes law. So we sent special assignment unit reporter Andrea McCarran, photojournalist John Moger, and our WUSA 9 service dog in training Nigel to Capitol Hill to show us the process. How does a bill become law? It all starts with an idea. Nigel brought his to Congressman Jamie Raskin, his representative. Nigel, are you ready for your lesson on how a bill becomes law? We draft the legislation. We introduce the bill by dropping it in the hopper on the floor of the House of Representatives. It gets assigned to a committee. And then uh, if everything's working well, there will be a hearing in the committee, maybe a subcommittee first. This part of the process can take a long time. And is discussed, debated, possibly changed. So where does it go next? And you send it to the House of Representatives, and they'll vote on it. And if they like it, they'll send it to the Senate. And if it passes exactly the same way, and every word and every comma and every period is exactly in the same place, then you've got uh, legislation that's passed and it gets sent to the president. If the House and Senate versions don't match, the bill goes to a conference committee. And they argue, 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 argue. And it kind of goes back and forth. And they argue, 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 argue. And so they both agree, yes, we like this version of it. Both sides hammer out their differences and come up with a consensus. Then the House and Senate vote again. Then on to the president. If that vote passes, the bill heads down Pennsylvania Avenue to the White House. There, the president has two options. Veto it or keep it. If the president signs it, the bill becomes law. With the PAWS Act, the bill was introduced simultaneously in the House and Senate. A bill can also originate on the Senate side, but ultimately both chambers of Congress have to vote to pass that same bill before it heads to the president.